Tesla announcing it has now chosen Robin Denholm uh, and has created a role for her to be the board chair. This is effective immediately. That move coming more than a month now after Elon Musk was forced to step down from the position as part of a settlement uh, with the SEC. He had 45 days to do that. Denholm is currently the CFO of Australian telecom operator Telstra. She's going to be leaving that role as part of this once her six-month notice period with the company is up and serve as chair as full time, uh, chair full time. It's, it's a full time job now. Uh, Denholm has also been an independent board member at Tesla since 2014. A Tesla spokesman says the company is still actively searching for two more independent board members. In a statement, Musk said Denholm has extensive experience in the tech and auto industries and has made significant contributions while on the board to help Tesla become profitable. By the way, temporarily she's going to step off the audit committee right. during this period. There had been a controversy with her role at Telstra uh, and Tesla because that's confused be uh, because, no <laughs> I mean, because of a, a uh, joint venture uh, marketing arrangement mm -hmm. that they had you sure a, that this story or is it, are we just mixing the names up? we're not mixing know. anything up but the real question is what kind of oversight she can provide and the question that that is that right that comes right to the surface on a day like today is she has been on the board for the past several years during and has done the, what? Exactly. And right. so I think there's going to be a lot of questions as to if, if there was an idea that, that this role not was a supposed clean to break. provide some kind right. of adult it, supervision right. that wasn't there before, how does and, this change and this it? was an opportunity for, for Tesla for Tesla to appoint somebody who was going to be a superstar chairman. Right. See, and that's a bit that, disqualifying right there, though. What? Tell us that you have to be Tesla so yeah, careful. I'm only careful because apparently you're confused, but nobody yeah, else right, is confused right. well, at this Tesla table this morning. It's early. Um, but there have been talk, you know, investors have been talking, you know, somebody like a Jim McInerney and Alan right. Mulally type right. to really, right. you know, you need somebody with the operational experience at this juncture in it has time. Has to be a Boeing person. Um, but this sort of makes you think that perhaps this is a placeholder of some sort because Musk is barred from serving as chairman right. for three years. So you put somebody who's friendly, caretaker. a caretaker right. position, somebody and then that you he put trusts. him back in. Right. He won't overshine what, him, outshine exactly. him. For flying cars? Like the... She apparently had seven years it, of it experience. Mulally and McNerney were both at Boeing. It'll be right? very you want a Boeing yeah. person? No, no, to... not a, but somebody with a tremendous operational okay. experience. Okay, doesn't have to be aer not aerospace, necessarily. No, okay. no, these are just regarded as people who and have, uh, you know, Just a quick note, tomorrow.